boy God. Definitely want to start the day off with some gratitude, thanking the Lord for all the blessings that we receive, and thanking Him for another beautiful day. So here we go, people! Take Action Tuesday, and I'm turned up. I hope that you are. You know, as the last, one of the last days of 2014, I'm thinking, looking back to everything that I've done over the last 90 days, especially this, this month of December. You know, I'm thinking about all the hard work and the dedication and focus, right? You know, a lot of people will stop doing what they're doing during the holidays, and they, you know, kind of uh, put a lax or put some brakes on. You know, I, I don't park <laughs> and um, I've been going hard this whole season, like just going hard and really, truly building my legacy and getting my uh, my business out there so that I can help as many people as possible. And, you know, those things are starting to come back now. They're coming back. They, you know, the people are, are coming back saying, hey, all right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. New year. New me. You know, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. And, you know, it's, it's a testament to never stop working. All right. Right? Never stop working towards your dreams. You know, it may be difficult at times. It may be challenging, but you must take action. So yesterday I went down to one of the gyms that I have enrolled and then I'm working with the nutrition program down there and, um, you know, got some NFL athletes, some uh, NCAA athletes, some high school athletes, which was truly, truly inspirational when you have a freshman in high school, junior in high school, you know, training as hard as a level of NFL guy. Um, you know, it just really opens my eyes to really seeing what dedication, hard work is and determination to be successful and seeing parents there supporting their children and their movement. So I'm down there and I'm observing everything that's going on. And it really reminded me back of myself, you know, when I was playing playing pro ball and how hard it was for me to go up against the challenges. Now, here I was coming from a small school, didn't play much college ball, and, you know, I'm sitting at this, at this round table get ready to work out for an arena football team. And I'm sitting there and I'm just really overwhelmed by the names and the pedigree that surrounded me. You know, the names in NC State and Notre Dame and Michigan State and, you know, and here I am coming from Southern Connecticut State University um, with not much college experience, but a lot of uh, minor league experience um, and looking for that shot. But you know what? Every single day I drove two and a half hours one way to Milford, Massachusetts every single day for two weeks to make camp. Now, while those other guys that had all those big names were up in hotels and they were staying there, I was traveling back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, back and forth for two weeks straight. And um, the moment came where I was actually, you know, sitting at the round table, had the owners, the, the, the management team, the coaches, the scouts, everybody sitting at that table. And they give me the news of you made the team. And, you know, the emotion that I had of accomplishment um, was something that I really can't explain, but I hope you could feel, you know, really what I was going through. It was my whole world of everything that I wanted to happen, happening all at once. And me finally being into a, able to accomplish what it means to be a paid professional football player. And, you know, it was, it was truly remarkable. And so yesterday when I was sitting there watching these players look for their dreams or currently playing for their dreams, it was truly inspirational. It showed me that everything that, you know, you do in your life, it has to be done at 100%. It has to be done at 110% and you have to take action. Massive activity is the only way that you're going to accomplish what it is that you're going to accomplish. If you die, if you stop for any second, if you stop, you know, um, what's his name? Um, um, uh, the motivational speaker, uh, Thomas, um, you know, Eric Thomas, he says, he says, if you stop, if you stop going for your dreams, you can set your dreams back six months or, or more by just stopping for one day, just stopping on that action that you're supposed to be taking. So my words to you guys today is take action. Here it is, you know, um, you know, December 30th, tomorrow being New Year's Eve. You know, what are you going to do today to take action? Are you going to take the day off? Are you going to go ahead and just continue to dream on? And are you going to take action? Are you going to take those activity steps going forward to make things happen? So guys, I hope those words really encourage you, you know, and really push you to do some great things today going into the new year. And, um, you know, guys, I really, really care about everyone's success and everybody should care about everyone's success because we are the makeup of the world. Okay, guys. And it starts with us as individuals building and structuring what it is that we want in our life, making those things happen so that the world can be a better place. All right, guys. Hey, we're going to have to release some, um, some information about the new year, new huge program guys. Definitely take a look at it. I got a couple options for you guys. 
guys. We've got some really great things going on um, starting uh, January 5th um, for those who really want to take action in their health and fitness and um, and really in their in their business as well. So guys, I wish you a great Take Action Tuesday. Sorry for the lengthy video, but I just had something to give, give you guys off my heart because you know what? Today's Take Action Tuesday and uh, it's the last one of the, new, of the year. So guys, God bless. I wish you a great Take Action Tuesday, guys. Talk to you soon.